What's happening out there everyone? It's Roll Easy here and welcome back to the channel. Today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to put any vehicle you want inside of any garage basically. Okay, you can put special vehicles, uh, you know, if you got the tank in the facility, I'm talking aircraft, uh, BMX bikes, anything. You can put them in your MOC, in your nightclub, in any garage, CEO garage, whatever you want. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to actually put a BMX bike in the nightclub so that you can do a money glitch all right there is a solo money glitch this method is 100% solo and if you have a BMX bike you can do the solo money glitch in my next video so this is pretty beneficial to a lot of people all right this is the these are the requirements okay now you want to go ahead and fill up B2 all right you need the nightclub and you want to go ahead and fill up level b2 and b4 all right b4 just fill it up with a bunch of rh8s b2 doesn't really matter what's in there honestly but b4 you want a bunch of rh8s like this so that is necessary now apart from that the founder i don't know if i said it it's nhj so big shout out to nhj link is down in the description now you also are going to need a few garages and i'm going to show you kind of how to set those up right now i like to do this glitch in a public session okay public session has a lot more lag and it will help when actually hitting this first part of the glitch. Now on PS4, we're gonna be using recent activities on Xbox, you do need a friend in another targeting mode, so it's kinda of like semi-solo on Xbox. But you don't need to contact your friend, you don't need to talk to them, nothing like that. You just need them in a different targeting mode, playing GTA Online. Now, look at my garages. You see my garages right here? Now, you need a two-car garage somewhere that's not in your top slot there. You need a two-car garage that's full with a BMX bike in it already. That's my second garage right there. Now, the first garage on top of your list, you want that to be like a 10-car or a 6-car garage. And in the first spot, I recommend having an RH8. If you want, first two spots have an RH8. So you want to set it up like that. That's how you want your garage to set up. Now, you also need an MOC with the personal vehicle storage, and you want it to be empty. Okay, you need the MOC to be empty. That's very important. And the best part is... To get this stuff to get this stuff done you know to get a bmx bike you only need to do all this once okay once and that's it so we're gonna get started here with the actual glitch and what you need to do is get a street car so i recommend like i said be in a public session i do think it helps at least it helps me a lot more but go into a public session now what you want to do is have your street car drive up to your garage now playstation get a recent activity ready play or xbox you're gonna need a friend in a different targeting mode so drive up to the garage hover over b2 now we're you want to go ahead and select b2 and remember it's full so you're going to get this alert right when you accept this playstation bring up the recent activity and sit on the alert so here we go i'm going to accept it double tap start just down line sit on this alert for i'd say 45 to 60 seconds okay i sit on it for a minute and i think that it works pretty well for me on xbox you want to do the same thing but i'd say join your friend in a different target mode before and then accept the full alert. You want that alert to come up quick and you want to accept the first alert and then sit on the second alert, which is the targeting mode. And like I said, sit on it for about a minute. Once you've sat on your alerts for about a minute, decline and you should be under the map. If you're not, you just try again, but you should be under the map, press wire triangle to get out of the vehicle and then you'll spawn back on top of the map like this. So at this point, you actually don't want to call out any personal vehicles whatsoever, all right? Don't call out anything, a bike, car plane nothing no personal vehicles out on the map you want to drop you want to grab a street car and this is the time where you're actually going to be heading over to that two car garage where i said you needed a bmx bike in so make sure you have that two car garage that has a bmx bike okay also request your moc if it's not on if it's not out on the map already you could request it before you do you know the glitch part right there at the nightclub but if you fail, then your MOC despawns. So that's why I recommend just calling the MOC out once you need it. So I'm taking my street car because I don't want a personal vehicle out on the map. And I'm, I called the MOC out. It's out on the map too. And I'm going over to my two car garage. Okay, that's this garage right here. I recommend getting garages really close to the nightclub so that, you know, it's really easy to do this and you don't have to travel really far. So here's my two car garage where I purchased a BMX bike in. I'm gonna get on the BMX bike and I'm gonna drive out. Don't tap X like I did, just literally press the right trigger or left trigger and you will you know, spawn outside. So now I have the BMX bike outside. At this point, you just need this out on the map, okay? So you can leave it wherever you want. Just go ahead and leave it out on the street, get another street car, and this is where you wanna head over to your MOC. So you want a street car that you, you, you'll, you'd be able to park inside your MOC. Don't get a really expensive street car that you can't store. 
So I have the street car right here and I'm just gonna drive over to the MOC and since I bought all my garages nice and close to the nightclub, it's not that bad of a drive. So here's my MOC spawn point. I'm gonna go ahead and remember the BMX bike is out on the map. Very important before you do this step. Whatever vehicle you want, aircraft, uh, you know, whatever it is, special vehicle, this is the time where you need it to be out on the map. Now, you go ahead and you just drive right into your MOC. You don't even need to press right D-pad, it sucks you right in. And remember, you want it to be empty. The MOC needs to be empty. So this is gonna be the only car in there. If you get stuck on this black screen here like I did, PlayStation do a recent activity and decline the alert. Xbox, different targeting mode alert. Accept the first alert and decline the second and you will get off of this black screen. So I'm gonna do my recent and then it's gonna show me outside here for a second, but then it will spawn me inside the MOC, okay? Now, all I gotta do is get back into the car and I'm actually gonna show you the plate because the plate will change once I spawn outside. So look at the plate, it says 47JQX, I believe. It's kind of hard to read for me for some reason. But I'm gonna drive out and you will see the plate be completely different, all right? So make sure you look at the plate before you do this just to make sure everything worked. There we go, 68, 970 at the end. Right there, that's a brand new plate. I know I'm good. So believe it or not, this is actually a BMX bike right now. That's why it changed the plate. We just overwrote the bike that was out on the map. And the streetcar, although it looks like the same car, it's actually a BMX. That's what the game is, it, you know, looks at it as. So at this point, this is where you want to take your technically BMX, but streetcar after, you know, you've driven it out of the MOC with the brand new plate. You want to take it back over to the nightclub. And remember I said B4, you want that to be level B4. You want that to be filled with RH8s. That's where we're going to be driving to. So I'm going to go to level B4 right here, accept the full alert. And when I go in there, it's going to ask me to replace over one of my RH8s in there, which is totally fine because I don't need those anyways. And you'll see this is how you put whatever vehicle you had on the map there, out on the map at that point with the MOC. So I already have a BMX bike actually on the floor, but I'm going to go ahead and actually replace over an RHA right next to it and have two BMX bikes just to show you that it did work. All right. For those of you that are skeptical. But as you can see right there, boom, two BMX bikes. I've just added this one. That other one I added before because I was testing some stuff out with the glitch. But this is how you get whatever vehicle you want. And when you have like a thruster or an aircraft in here, sometimes they can even fly in here. So they're pretty fun to, uh, you know, screw around with. But that's it, all right? Once you have one BMX bike, you never need to do these steps again, all right? I'm gonna show you how to actually duplicate your BMXs really fast and easily, okay? And this is why we set up our garages in the, you know, in the beginning of the video. Make sure you set up your garages the way that I did so that you can do this part right here. So I'm gonna head over now to the garage that's first on my list, Spanish Avenue. Remember I said that was important. Whatever garage is first on your list, you want that to be a 10 or six car garage. This is my Spanish Avenue apartment, okay? so. I'm gonna go into the Spanish Avenue apartment. Like I said, it must be the first garage on your mechanics list. So check it before you even start this entire video. All right, and make sure you have that set up. And like I said, you want an RH8 in slot one. Slot one and two would probably be the best because you're gonna be getting a lot of BMXs. So pay attention. Open up your phone, go to the internet, and now go to travel and transport, pedal to the metal, and this is where you buy the BMX bikes. So we're gonna buy a bike and look where I put it. So I'm gonna go down the list and you see the two car garage where we pulled out the BMX bike before? Select that garage, the two car garage. Select the two car garage and you see that glitched out screen? That means we're good to go. Just go ahead and press X or A once again, you'll get a replace alert, that's fine. Accept it and what just happened, believe it or not, we just ordered a BMX bike and it went into this first garage into the first slot. That's why we wanted the RH8 there. Okay, very important so that you don't override a car that you care about. So now at this point, we are like pretty much done. That's how you actually buy more BMX bikes. So say you wanted to buy another one right now, just go ahead and swap spots. Make sure you have an RH8 in slot one and you can do the same thing. Open up your phone and order a bike into the two car garage and it'll glitch out for this garage. So now we have bikes in car slots. So for the duplication glitch, if you do want to set up for the solo money glitch, which is the main purpose of this video, I wouldn't post it if it didn't lead to a money glitch, to be honest. So at this point, where do we need our BMX bikes for the money glitch? We actually need to transfer the BMX bikes over to the facility. So what you want to do is just go outside, open up your phone, call your mechanic, and you want to order up whatever cars. I recommend having RH8s because they're way easier to use, but order up whatever car you have over at your facility and you want to drive it into this garage where you have the BMX bikes. Or if they're in the nightclub, you drive them into the nightclub, wherever you have your BMX bikes. Just get a car from your facility, bring it to one of these garages with a BMX, 
select to transfer the vehicle, and there we go. I have a new RH8 here, which is good because I'm going to need it anyways. And now that BMX went over to the facility, which we're going to need for the duplication glitch. So that's it, guys. You only need to do the first part once. After that, once you have one BMX, you just do the rest, the last part of the video, over and over again to get more BMX bikes. Okay? So stay tuned for the next solo money glitch video. That's going to be it for me. My name is Roll Easy. Please subscribe to the channel if you're brand new by hitting that big red button. Turn on post notifications and drop a fat like on this video and the rest of my videos for the freshest and the most informative dope GTA 5 online content. We are on the road to 50,000 subscribers. Peace out.